What's going on, my guys? Welcome back to my channel. I'm Garrett with Game by the Beach. Very excited to be here with you today because we're going to be showing off one of my absolute favorite combos to play for this week. We got Demon Hunter Sword, which we've already played a little bit, plus Cauldron, where Cauldron is just so, so good this week. Spamming out mana left and right. We're working on getting our 10 stacks. We are actually successful at getting a 10 stack sword on a demon hunter you absolutely love to see it guys grab your coffee grab your device and let's head on down to game by the beach welcome back once again fellas very happy to be here with you we're going to be playing a little bit more demon hunter we played demon hunter the other day with this deck except we had mime in here instead of cauldron but cauldron in here is like a double whammy okay because it's part of the magic council which means you're getting that extra multiplication in there for uh for mana plus it's cauldron you're getting mana no matter what so it's kind of a little double two for one right there on mana and uh we've still got sword in there harlequin dryad we're gonna have a what a 1.45 multiplication i think something like that which I think should work out pretty well. And Demon Hunter's been so fun that I wanted to keep it going. This is what we're going to be rocking with with M Magic Cauldron. I pretty much rock these sets. The only one that I change is, is Cooling or Magic. So for Magic, it does damage. Cooling, it does slow. We're going to go Magic. I don't really care about slow. With Demon Hunter, you're either taking them out or you're not. Slow is not really going to help us in the long run. Dryad, we're going to be going with the right fairy of rage we got no talents on anything else and we're rocking equipment which i'm pretty much going to stay with all week because it's magic council sturdy staff uh magic council mage robes as well as well this one changes a little bit this one's not magic council but i like having a buffed tile on my board but without further ado let's jump into the first game of the morning first game underway and let's see what we can do so pretty much a mirror matchup let's say he's got sword as well his is level nine which always makes me a bit nervous but uh it is demon hunter versus demon hunter he's got summoner we've got cauldron i was actually gonna do i'm gonna do this which is a weird play maybe but i'm gonna do it either way um i was actually gonna focus way more in on cauldron early but just kind of by the cards that we found, I'm focusing more on, um, I'm just going to do that. Why not focus more on my sword to start? He hit my, the one that I was trying to survive. And remember, Cauldron also levels up your cards periodically. So it's going to help us get to 40 tiers, which is realistically the most important part. But uh, at the same time, sword is just as important. I'm going to do that. We got a rank, high rank in cauldron. I'm going to try and keep my board pretty full. Like this guy got up to four because of cauldron. That's super, super useful. Let's keep our board full because notice this guy just sitting there. He's going to be sitting there. He's going to be sitting there. So we've got, oh, I didn't mean to merge that, but it's fine. Um, so he's going to be getting his sword stacks up constantly. And he's going to be ranking mine down constantly. Which is a really, really bad spot for us. And a really great spot for him. But that's the plight of the level 9 sword versus the uh, the uh, level 8 sword, I guess I have. But okay, it should be alright. Let's try and see when he gets a sword rank up. If it hits one of those rank 3 demon hunters, let's see where he's actually at. So he hit, he hit my cauldron right there, which is fine. Hit that guy. 3-4. Wow. Oh, he's got two of them now. Oh, my gosh. Don't you dare switch me, boy. Okay. I'm just going to do this because we've got a bunch of these that we can copy. I'm going to go right there. This guy's at five. Absolutely going to level him up. Uh, we'll go here. We're going to go there. This is pretty much a battle of... He's going to kind of sit and hang for most of this game trying to level up all his stuff. 
we're gonna be much more aggro we're gonna be spamming we're gonna we should have a ton of mana pretty much at all times um which i would say is a more fun style of play but to each their own we're gonna do that right there uh didn't hit what we wanted to hit we can actually merge these out why not what's the worst that can happen that's the worst that could happen but this guy got ranked up so don't mind that we don't have a sword to to rank up so i'm just gonna do this we actually made it to 25 tiers already and we've still got 5,000 mana to spare okay let's see i'm gonna just do this i'm gonna do that i'm gonna do this oh that could have been really cool can we get some... I don't even know what I want. Swords, I guess? Let's do that. I'm going to merge these out. Uh, I guess we'll go here. I've kind of uh, given up on sword at this point. No, I'm, I'm, I haven't. I haven't. Just a, just a little bit. All right, we can do that. Keep it going. Where are we at? 30? Okay. Okay. We're at 30. We still have a ton of mana. Let's max out our boy. He's at 19, but he may be getting to a stack soon. So let's just be prepared for that. But the fact that we've got a 4 and a 5 cauldron is actually, actually like super, super, super bad. Let's merge that guy out because he uh, he had a debuff anyway on the sword. Uh, I guess we'll go here because he's got a positive buff. We're going to have to merge these guys out. Merge those guys out. I'm going to do this as well. We've still got a ton of mana. I'm going to merge these guys. We're going this way. Please give me a cauldron to merge out. Yikes. We're going to have to do this. This is the problem with this deck that you uh, you can get landlocked pretty quickly. And if you do... I don't know. That's kind of it. Ooh, low power mode. Oops. I don't even know if it popped up for you guys or not, but uh, we got to get this game going. We're at 31. He's at 25. I don't have a ton of plays to make. He's continuously coming down and hitting me. We're going to have to merge out. We'll just do this. That was good. That's not what I meant to do, but it'll work. We'll go there. We'll go there. Rank threes we can merge out. Another rank four. I'll take that. Cauldrons for a cauldron. Rank five for rank five. We're at 38. Boom. 40. This deck is so quick. We got to 40 right there. The only problem is as we sit here, we're just going to continuously get hit by his sword. Let's take a peek at his equipment. Uh, level 1, level 8, rare. Wow, his equipment is not that great. I'm surprised he has a level 9 sword. He got a stack. He got a level 10, level 10 sword. I'm really, really jealous. I mean, we even have the opportunity, perhaps, of getting um, a level 10 debuff sword. Oh, my gosh. Can we get hit with another something? Look at this. One, two, three, four, five. We're at 35. He's at 28. We're still in the lead here, but he's got a sword stack. Is it weird that I want to just wait for the next lion? Virus is going to be interesting for the both of us, to be honest. I do have rank threes. I could rank out rank threes. This guy's also a debuff, so he's asking for it. If it hits my rank three, it's telling me. It did not. 32. I mean, his board is so much more open than mine that he's got a much better chance of um, getting to those 40 stacks. And we're losing. We're losing. I don't think we've gotten to our active ability on our gadget either. Yeah, that's an open square right there. So that's that's all you need to know. He hasn't gotten to his trainer, though. Is this just going to be a nail-biter? What a weird game. Maybe the slow would have helped. Hit him with a good game. We got stuck there. We absolutely got stuck. If you don't get stuck, we would have been at, like, 50 tiers. One of those demon hunters was something, or one of those cauldrons were something else. 
we would have been in really good shape. We already looked at his equipment, nothing too crazy. Level 9 versus level 9, but I got a bunch of crit on him. Level 9 sword, gosh, it makes such a difference. I have a book, I got pages. I don't want to level up a level 8 to a level 9 sword. But gosh, it makes a difference. He, uh, he got his to 10 stacks. I've played Demon Hunter a good few times this week. With sword, still have been unable to get one to a 10 stack. I think the key, A, the key is going against somebody who's not rocking sword, which we have not done while running cauldron, so maybe that makes a difference, but uh, only time will tell. That's one game in the books. Let's jump into one more, see if we can find somebody who's not rocking sword, and see if we can actually get to a 10 stack demon hunter. I think that would be pretty sweet. Second game underway here, and uh, we're going up against Blade Dancer. Ooh, but we are going up against um tribunal to start which will be interesting we got a million cauldrons a million dryads all we need is a measly demon hunter and my man's gonna get ranked up immediately all right so no swords as of yet but we got a bunch of cauldrons so let's level up a couple cauldrons here i really like playing cauldron in this deck it makes it so different it makes it so that I'm not even focusing on swords, but we don't even have to copy cauldrons. We don't even have to level cauldron up. It's just sitting there profiting so much for us. And uh, yeah, I mean, look how good a spot we're already in. And we haven't found a single sword, which is our pretty much our focal point for this deck, which is really, really funny. And if we can do a decent, decent amount of work here, um, we may be able to take out tribunal before it hits us still no swords pretty wild i'm just gonna go full cauldron here and i'm just gonna level up my uh my demon hunters let's get them to max why the heck not let's start with our cauldron then go demon hunter to max and then uh i'm probably gonna combine out just a couple of my cauldrons before tribunal gets here just to get us over 10 i think 10 is the first um visual change for demon hunter where you get that first buff i don't actually know the specific buffs at the specific stages i know 25 is one and i forget if 10 or if it's 15 or whatever it is um but yeah we haven't found a single sword which is kind of funny but at the same time a little bit sad let's just combine out a couple times and uh all right we're at 13 i'll do that still didn't find any uh demon hunters or yeah whatever let's see i think we'll take it out i, I really hope we take it out and if we don't, we'll figure it out. Ah, gosh, that actually is really sad. I guess we should have done more. Okay, so we're going to go full in on um, swords now. We'll go here. One, one on a, on a couple of good ones. I'll do that. Two and a three is good. Uh, he's hitting me with a good game. I'm not sure why. Okay, we can just do... Uh, let's just start with that. I'm going to do... We got Warlock next, so we should be protected a bit now. Combine out Cauldrons. We'll do a sword. That's not the sword I want. Another sword. Hmm. Sword not really cooperating. This dude's having so much trouble in this game. I'm just going to do this because we've got a rank 3 that we could get rid of if we want to. Didn't hit what we wanted to. But that's okay. We got another rank 4. We're already at 24. Can we get to 25 just to make it pretty? 25. He is holding out for dear life. Combine out your, your, your portals, dude. All right, move that one. Move it. Why wouldn't you move it under the knight statue? survive combine out your portals move it onto a knight statue 18 seconds i'm gonna hit my gadget i feel like you're not in as bad a spot as you're looking like oh my gosh hit him with a good game you had like a million portal keepers combine them out give up on the idea of trying to find a demon uh trying to find a uh a uh pfft blade dancer and just start merging if you're gonna lose you just gotta merge that deck that that game barely counts second game whew, 
done. Third game, let's get into it. Third and final game, no matter what happens, let's do it. We've got ourselves an uh, Inquisitor deck. We're already having trouble finding uh, swords again. Max Inquisitor. Definitely a tall task. Let's see what we can do. I'm just going to combine that out. Let's do that. All of them are aggro swords, which is a little annoying. He's also finding... Dude, play this deck and your opponent will brick. Come on. I said third and final game no matter what. Don't make me a liar now. Find an inquis. I want you to find an inquis. I want a game. I want it. Come on. There we go. Oh, he's doing Night of Light, though. He's doing Night of Light. Pretty cool. Let's check it out. Yep, yep. It is Max. Let's check out his equipment. He's enchanted over here. So pretty solid stuff. All right. Well, now we know. Okay, so for that last game, we did not take out Tribunal before it hit. Kind of surprised, but that's the reality. So I think what we're going to do here is pretty much merge out as much as we can before Tribunal. And, uh, and see what we can do after that. That's a nice little spot for him there. He's got four. Those probably aren't going to be there to stay forever. I'm just going to start spamming. Because what's the worst that can happen? I'm just going to do that. I'm going to do that. I'm going to do that. I'm going to do this also. I'm going to go over here. Got a cauldron right there, rank three. I'd rather turn that into a couple of dryads. We hit all of his inquises right there. We've got three, six, seven units on our board. I guess I'll just do that because it's a stack. I knew we weren't going to be able to take it out because of our little tester in the last one. Uh, we can do this and this and this and that. And we should have some pretty good chances of hitting the units that we want. This guy's at three. So that's the guy that's my priority. Okay. That's my priority right there. Let's see what we can find here. We're going to do a little this. We hit him again. We're at four. This guy's at four too. Cauldron. Uh, we'll do that. Five and two. We'll do another one. Hmm, we'll just do that to get it away. I don't know what this guy's at. It's probably something decent. I'm going to go right here. That guy's at four, which isn't bad. Uh, I'm just going to merge these. Little rank up right there is huge. That in itself is enough to have cauldron in here that you're getting free rank ups here and there. It's crazy. We're going to hit right there. He can cleanse all the swords that I spammed, which I just remembered. So, we don't really care about hitting his swords or not. We're just going to kind of just go with what we can do. We're going to focus on ourselves. I'm going to go. Let's merge that out. Get that guy up. Um, I'm going to go here. So, that guy's at five. I like our board. I'm going to do this. We have a couple Demon Hunters at 5, actually. A couple at 6 now. We're going to go 4 right there. This guy's decently leveled up, so maybe we get him at 4 next. Um, I'm going to merge out Cauldrons. Merge out Cauldrons again. Get that guy to four. Give me a blue one. Yes, sir. That guy's at seven. Hmm. That guy's at seven. We got a couple at seven. This is by far the best we've done at leveling up our stacks here, especially because he doesn't have sword. Uh, but we still got a long way to go. I'm just going to do this, this, and that. Don't necessarily know exactly where they stand, but I'm going to stand by it. That's eight. 
I'm gonna combine out here. Definitely gonna go there with that guy. Couple of aggro swords. I guess we'll just spam it out. No reason to hold on to them. We'll do that. Oh, man. Uh, we'll do this. This deck is so much fun to play. It's crazy. Okay, okay, okay. Um, We're getting stuck. We're getting stuck. All right, that guy's stacked. Let's just max out our man. We've got 2,000 mana still. We've got a cauldron there. Combine those out. Combine out my demon hunters. We're going to have to do that. They're not going to really do much for us. We can go here. That guy's at eight now. Uh, we could do this. That guy's at nine. Come on, baby. He's at nine. We could absolutely get to uh, 40 tiers if we wanted to. We're at 31. Let's see what he hits. Probably my rank five. Rank four. Close enough. Um... Gosh, I don't even know what I want to do here. <sighs> I think I'm just going to do this and that. A little unfortunate there. I don't I don't really have a play. I guess we can just do that. Come on, blue one. Blue one, hit it. Come on, hit it. Uh, we could do this. We're at 39. Holy smokes, that's a lot of damage. All right, gosh, we're at 30. Well, we're at 40 tiers. We could obviously get to 43 if we wanted to. But this guy's at 9. I think this guy's at either at 8 or 9. We're stinking right there. And you know what, dude? We've got a rank 4 cauldron sitting there. We've got a bunch of rank 3s that we could merge out if we wanted to. It really makes me think. Let's see what we hit. It hits a rank four. Uh, nothing I can do there. So we're going to go under. I'm gonna just going to do this. We're going to go over there. I'm dying for a sword, boy. Double blue. We got a 10. It's only a rank three, but we got a 10. And I, dude, it's so hard to know which ones are... Uh, are close to stacks and which aren't but i didn't even know this why this guy was at nine i could have just as easily merged this guy out when i combined out rake threes but i didn't and now we have one at stack finally we have one at, at 10 stacks monkey king don't you dare hit us oh, now it's ranked down to a rank two we've got so much mana let's do something oh gosh we can't really do anything and his knight statues Plus his Inquis, I mean, it's it's a near impossible combo to beat. We've got Tribunal next, which we're probably going to take a hit from. Lion's going to keep on coming down and hitting us. Lion's going to keep coming down and hitting him, but he's actually slowing down. He can obviously spam, so hit his knight, his uh, Inquis. Let's see if he tries to find an Inquis and and uh, and cleanse it. He didn't. If he, even if he was trying to, he didn't do it in time. This guy's only a rank two, which is definitely a shame. But maybe when Tribunal hits us, if, he, if we do take a hit, um, it'll open up some space on our board. We can combine out a little bit and maybe find that 10th stack for some of these guys. And then also rank this guy up with some Dryads, maybe. And then still get back to 40. We got 33,000 mana, dude. The last thing we need to worry about is mana. So it's just getting landlocked. That's the only thing I'm worried about. We did take a hit, so I'm absolutely going to combine these guys out. We can go here. Um, I'm honestly going to do that also. I'm going to do that. Uh, 33. Holy smokes. 33? Wow, that's, t that's really bad. We're going to go there. We're going to do this. Oh, no. Oh, no. We got landlocked. We got landlocked. I'm going to have to combine out my rank, my, my, my max. Uh, and that's how quick the tables turn. Gosh. That's how quick the tables turn. Hit him with a good game. All right, fellas. Demon Hunter, super, super fun. I absolutely love that deck. 
it almost doesn't matter what Inquis deck uh, you play because uh, they just they're just gonna outlast you. Demon Hunter super fun. We had forty something stacks. We got hit by Tribunal, hit by Lions left and right. You got nothing to protect. Maybe if I had Mermaid, I could like try and protect against Tribunal or something. I need a boss or not a boss, a hero that would actually protect me, and then maybe Demon Hunter can hang. But the damage isn't the problem. The problem is staying at 40 tiers, and when you're getting barraged by mini-bosses and bosses, it's nearly impossible to compete with those types of decks. But try this deck out. We did get 10 stacks on our sword, finally. Uh, it just wasn't the one that we necessarily wanted, and it didn't really matter at the end. But guys, that's going to be the end of this YouTube video. If you enjoyed, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll check you guys out in tomorrow's video.